After spending a week with a 2016 Mustang GT, here are some of the things we love about it. First off, this GT comes with the performance package. That means six piston Brembo brakes. The brakes are fantastic. The car stops really well, instant brake response. Also, we've got independent rear suspension. That is all the hype for the new S550 generation Mustang as compared to the live axle in previous generations. It really does handle a lot better, especially with the performance package. You've got tighter springs, aggressive rear sway bar, different tuning. It actually feels like it can do a lot more than just go in a straight line. One of the best parts of the new Mustang is the interior. They made great changes with material choices, the design and the fit and finish and the features offered. Sync 3 is a big step up from the previous infotainment systems. Uh, you got some nice toggle switches here. Everything just feels like a much more premium vehicle. Next is the exterior. Both of us really like the way the exterior of the Mustang looks. Now we understand that when it was initially released, it kind of took people by surprise. Yeah. It looks a lot more refined and European, not the retro like, muscle car look. Like, yeah. Exactly. But as people have gotten used to it, as it's become more normal to see these Mustangs on the road, it's incredible how designers know what looks good before you do. <laughs> it looks aggressive in a classy way. Yeah. The rear taillights are also I like the Maybe rear end a lot it. more. It uh, looks a little bit wider. It looks like it sits lower. It just overall sculpts in a way that looks more purposeful and also, again, a little more refined in a way. The Ford Mustang is all about performance. Starting at around $35,000 for a Mustang GT, you get 435 horsepower and zero to 60 in the mid four second range. That is really quick. Downshift in the second, floor it. I don't think anybody would ever get into this car and say, mm, not that's fast not fast enough. enough. Yeah, it's good. Lastly, the seats. This has the optional upgraded Recaro bucket seats. They're great. They hold you really nicely. Great side bolstering. These are also leather covered, so they feel a little more premium, but it strikes a good balance between being comfortable, but also serving the purpose of holding you in place. Good option. Definitely. Like the performance package, you got to have it. The Recaro seats, they are 1600 bucks, but I'm pretty sure worth it. after a year or two of ownership, you'll be glad you purchased them. Well, there you have it. After a week of driving this Mustang, we both really, really liked it. I hope you have found this video informative. Like always, please browse our channel and subscribe. Look forward to seeing you next video.